Hello and welcome to the Performance Radio's Binding Tutorial video. In this video, we'll cover how to bind a node to a gateway. The binding process provides a secure mode of communication between gateways and nodes and must be done for them to communicate. All other radios outside a bound network are ignored. Before powering up your radio, ensure the antenna is attached. Powering up a radio without an attached antenna could potentially damage the radio's amplifier board. Since the gateway can communicate with up to 47 nodes, each node must have its own address. Addresses are selected via the rotary dials. The first node's address should be 01, the second 02, and so on. Next, ensure the node is at least 8 feet from the gateway. Nodes, however, do not need to be separated from each other. To start the binding process, Place the gateway in binding by triple clicking button number 2. You will see binding flash across the display. Next, place the node in the binding mode by triple clicking button number 2. Binding will flash across the display. When the node binds to the gateway, you will see bound. The number 1 and 2 LEDs will flash 4 times and the node will automatically return to the run mode. When binding nodes that do not have rotary dials that allow you to select their address, addressing is done via the gateway. Power up the node by holding down its power button until its power LED turns on. Then triple click the same button. The node's green and red LED will flash four times, indicating that the node has bound successfully to the gateway. The node will automatically return to the run mode. If additional nodes need to be bound, set the next node's address by advancing the rotary dial count on the gateway and repeat the process. When finished, double click button number 2 on the gateway to take it out of the binding mode. Finally, remember to place the number of the node on its housing. This will aid you in finding the proper node if you need to troubleshoot or replace it. Thanks for watching.